Hello. Welcome to Jason Chats. This is jasonnewland.com. This is me and Andre. Um, so it's snowing today. Been snowing. I went to bed at about half six, six o'clock, something like that. And it was just raining. There was no snow at all. And when I woke up at 10, half nine, 10 o'clock or something, snow everywhere. So I got up and I took my little boy out. We went to the garage and got some milk but I took him and I made a little video earlier and I put it onto Facebook and I've added it onto my blog where I've got him wearing a little Santa Claus Father Christmas hat and he's just going out into I've just opened the front door and he's just going out and then he comes back in again but what you don't see and I couldn't film it because it was snowing and I didn't want my phone to get all wet, uh, is he absolutely loved the snow. Loved it. Absolutely loved it. And he was, just loved putting his, his nose in and just digging up the snow, like a little pathway. So he, he, I think his, his body temperature rose or something to keep him warm really wasn't bothered by the cold or the snow. Loved it, didn't you love it? Yes, you do. And <laughs> he's just staring at me. He's just staring at me. What are you staring at me for? What are you staring at me for? Last night, I didn't put him in his cage at all. I just let him just do what he wanted to do. And at one point, I think it was about, I think it was about half nine, 10 o'clock. He was trying to wake me up. He was trying to wake me up. And how he was doing it is by he was licking my lips and he started biting my lips, but just gently, not trying to hurt me, because if he wanted to, he could, I could put me in hospital if he wanted to, but very gently, just enough trying to get me to wake up, weren't you? It's as if he knew that it was snowing and he wanted to go out on it. It's really strange. It's one of those things that when he's awake, he wants me to give him lots of attention. And he what don't you? Eh? But when he's asleep, he wants me to leave him alone. It's very strange though, because I went to sleep earlier during the day and I had a really nasty dream where I close his ears here where he, he died and it was because of a monster and it was it was quite like it was uh, quite nightmarish and I was really upset and yeah even though there's lots of horrible things happening the only thing that really affected me emotionally was him losing him I can't believe I got attached to a little <laughs> wiggly thing look look hello hello Look, what's that? 
He's such a bum bum. He's such a bum bum. <laughs> so yeah, it's uh, yeah, nothing much going on really. I've been in bed most of the day. Uh, I think the stopping smoking's kind of taken it out of me a little bit. I really wanted a cigarette today, but I didn't have one. Did not have one. Although I wanted to, I wanted, but I didn't have it. So, oh, oh, okay. The fact is, I was thinking of buying some tobacco. But luckily, what I did yesterday is I bought myself a light bulb for the bathroom. <laughs> it's exciting stuff, this. So I got that on, uh, getting that delivered, and I've also got myself some Amazon gift vouchers, and I'm going to give those away as presents uh, to family for Christmas. So I've got some of my Christmas shopping done already, which is good. <sighs> and I'll do the rest on Wednesday, and then I'll be done. And then whatever I get paid on Wednesday, take off the bills, electric, gas, all that stuff, and then bills as far as, you know, like Christmas shopping, and then food, and that hopefully will leave me with about £20 to get through until next week. And so yeah, it's a case of just getting it over and done with really, just, I don't even celebrate Christmas, it's not really a, a thing I do, uh, on Christmas day I'll be here on my own, well I'll be here with Andre, so I won't be on my own, I'll be with him, and it doesn't really hold much in the way of meaning to me as it would, I suppose, if I had, I suppose if I had kids or that kind of stuff, it'd have some kind of meaning, but Christmas hasn't really held much for me since I was a kid. You know, since I was about 14, 15. Yeah, I think Christmas on my 14th birthday, on my 14th year, was the last one that was really a, no, 15. Can't remember what happened, but I suppose when Christmas when I was 15 was probably the last Christmas. Or well, 14 was the last one with the family, like where it was my brothers and, you know, all together. Maybe even 13, but I think 14 was the last one. And then when I was 15, I was I can't remember can't remember it's a long time ago you know I'm 47 now so it's a long time it's what 32 years ago so I don't really celebrate Christmas it doesn't it's not something that I really get into and I might I might get a few drinks this year. Maybe get a bo bo bottle of Jack Daniels or something, and just have a just have a few drinks over the Christmas period. But I might not even do that. Might treat myself to a shower. But yep, yeah, that's it. Another boring vlog. <laughs> So I'm gonna go, Andre. Can you do? A, can you wipe your ass on the carpet, please? Oh, thank you. That's a good boy. So I'm gonna go. Um, I'm gonna see you all later on. I'll be playing around with my uh, test scam recording studio thing. And I think, 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 I may be ready to make a recording. I think, maybe, we'll see. Oh, shit, that was a weird noise. 
we'll see. So I'm gonna go. I would like to yeah make a, a new session soon. Still working on the website. It's never ending. Never bloody ending. Yesterday I uploaded a few old videos from 2009 onto my blog, my Jason Chats vlog. Uh, these are ones that I had, I found on um, I don't know, a video, video um, uploading channel. I forget which one it is now. Uh, not YouTube, but another one. But oh, I kind of wish I just kept kept all my videos, all my vlogs, the way I sort of kept the hypnosis stuff. Because I'd have had hundreds probably. This would have been interesting just to look back on them maybe to see what I was going through or what I was thinking at the time, you know? Maybe that's what this is now, maybe that's why I'm doing this now. Just as a like a little diary ish thing. Not very exciting, but yeah, just to keep track. So the coming week Um, yeah, I'm gonna get a delivery, I get some food. Uh, I've got a health check as well with the mental health team. It's a health check, it's a physical health check to see if I'm all right. So I'm gonna be getting blood pressure done and all that stuff. Um, and that's it for this week. And then next week, I've got, but I'm also going to visit family, and I've got, um, oh, I've got, yeah, a social worker coming to see me. As far as visiting anyone, it depends on the weather. I'm not going to travel if it's snowing or if it's icy, if, you know, the, all the trains are delayed and stuff like that, I can't be bothered with that. So I won't be doing that, I'll just send uh, presence in the post and yeah, in fact I might even do that anyway I well, might but I might not it do depends on what I want to do so I'm gonna go I'm gonna go and I'm gonna see you later uh, uh, l l l l later uh, 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 uh. by the way you can Keep updated by subscribing to my channel. There's a subscribe box right at the top of the page. Um, you just put in your email address and become a subscriber of, or whatever you want to call it. And you get updates when I make new videos and stuff like that, I guess. Uh, I don't actually do anything myself. I think it just does it. I think it just lets you know. But um, when I ever do make a new video, I'll make a a vlog and announce it anyway. Unless I'm doing a new video every day, then maybe I won't, you know. Anyway, I'm going to go. You know what I really need right now? I need something to go along with my ice cream. I want to have a snack, I want to have a cake or something like that, but I've got nothing. I've got no biscuits, I've got no chocolate, I've got no, I just had my last yoghurt, so I haven't got none that. I've got one juice drink, and that's it. Um, I've got nothing that I can have. I've got, I've got a tub of yog, um, of ice cream, vanilla ice cream, and it's not all full, but it's enough there for a few more bowls, but I've got nothing to put with it, I could just have it on its own, yeah I could, you know, uh, you know, I'd rather, I'd rather have something warm with it, something like pastry or sponge pudding or something, basically anything that I haven't got 
I'm dreaming about toffee, toffee fudge pudding or something like that. Oh. But I can't because I ain't got it. The only frozen stuff I've got is food, you know, to cook, to eat. I've got no sweets or desserts or anything. It's just annoying because I've, I've got this want, I really want it. I didn't even get anything at the garage. Because I haven't bought any Coke, uh, chocolate or any, anything like that. I've stopped drinking Coke, stopped, haven't eaten any chocolate for a few couple of weeks or whatever. So I haven't, I've got out of the practice of buying that stuff. So I don't even think about buying it when I'm in a shop. And now, because usually, to be fair, when I did buy that stuff, I'd buy it from the supermarket. So I'd get it cheap. I wouldn't buy the expensive ones in the garage. I'd get a pack of, you know, six for a pound or whatever from Iceland or wherever. Not, not the country, the shop that we have in this here country. Iceland. Iceland. And anyway, I'm hungry. I'm not hungry because I just eaten. I want chocolate. I want cake. That's what I want. And I don't have none. I don't have anything at all. And I'd be willing to stick the oven on and wait 20 minutes and you know put it in the oven and wait another half hour before having the dessert if I had something to put into the oven, but I do not. Which is annoying me. Anyway, I'm gonna go, you take care, and I'll speak to you later on. Bye for now, bye.